Civil society organizations in Nigeria have asked the federal government to come up with a structure that will show transparency and accountability in the management and utilization of COVID-19 emergency relief funds received to cushion the effect of the coronavirus pandemic. Speaking in Abuja, the unveiling of findings on a project, COVID-19 Transparency and Accountability Project, CTAP, the CSOs say its finding reveals that government received about $5.6 billion as intervention from both domestic and foreign donors, which has not been adequately accounted for. They also say that the large sum received by Nigeria as loans and grants created room for corruption and fraudulent activities in the distribution of palliatives and however called on citizens to hold government to account. We've, we've had an increase in loan uh, that have been collected both from IMF and other multilateral, but we've not seen a clear cut strategy from governments on how this loan will be paid. And as a young man particularly, I'm much more concerned because I know that this is some loan that my generation would pay back for when some of these old politicians are older. As much as we're talking about repaying back loans, how is the government of the day using this loan? Because when you go to the grassroots, a lot of citizens will tell you that they only hear about palliative from radio and TV. But on the ground, there's nothing happening. And you've even seen reports that have been highlighted today. We've done our findings. So we found that palliative and support to people um, were heavily politicized. Uh, we found that the, the presence of media men also short changed the beneficiaries in the process. Uh, we also saw gross inadequacy of some of this support. When you have like a large community and you put five bags of rice and, and two cartons of milk and you think that can go around up to like 4,000 people. That's, you know, situations like that happen. So we also want the government to appraise its palliative mechanisms. See. With all of the funds received in the fight of COVID-19, there have been several calls by the Civil Society for Transparency and Accountability in the distribution of these funds. Given the citizens' access to data, which will reflect the funds received the channels through the, uh, uh, which they are disbursed down to who the recipients of the funds are. Transparency is important on its own because it allows learning. It allows people to see the contribution to accountability. It also shapes the organizational performance of whoever is making contributions. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.